Let's deal with negativity. Maybe you're caught in a pattern. Maybe there's been a series of circumstances that have thrown you into a place where it's hard to see the future in a friendly kind of way. And what we have in front of us is the opportunity to use a Kundalini yoga practice of mantra and breath work and visualization in order to break that spell. I'll call it a spell to break that um, pattern of thinking so that we have a little bit more objectivity and to explore the other possibilities of what life is offering. But first, my name is Salima, yoga therapist, and welcome to my channel, Kundalini Yoga Online. And here, what we do is explore all the practices of Kundalini Yoga, the history, philosophy, as well as all the practices in order to build out a robust way of thinking about ourselves in a modern context with healing, well-being, and spirituality as part of the journey. How's that sound? If all of that resonates for you, you're in the right place. Let's begin now by taking a few moments to sit comfortably, to relax into the practice, to prepare the mind, body, spirit for what's to unfold. Let's do that a couple more times. Inhale, exhale. Inhale very deeply, exhale. Beautiful. Take a moment now to shake out your body. Shake, shake, shake. And this is a way of resetting the nervous system. It's one of my go-tos. You can do it any time during the day to shake off a bad mood, shake off a stuck feeling, shake off a circular kind of thought. And here we're just playing with the fingers. Tickle, tickle. Awesome. Amazing. And this gives us a lot of place to begin our practice. So we'll start by tuning in using a mantra to tune the body, mind, and spirit into our practice and to really set the stage for some changes, some shifts in perspective. So sitting up tall and straight, this mantra in the sacred language of Gurmukhi means, I call on the teacher within. I bow to my internal wisdom. Inhale very deeply, exhale completely, inhale, exhale, inhale, and let's tune in. Oh. Feel that resonance. And we're using that same technology of sound vibration to begin the next part of our practice. This particular meditation has three components in it. And the first one starts with mantra and mudra. And so here is the mantra. It's called the magic mantra. It is a mantra to reverse negativity. So it's very appropriately being used here. The sounds are ek onkar, sat gur prasad, sat gur prasad, ek onkar. So if you follow that, we're doing ek onkar, sat gur prasad, and then reversing it. Sat Gur Prasad Ek Onkar. Amazing. So that'll show up here on the screen so you can see it. And then we have a mudra. And the mudra, bring the thumb to cover the pinky finger and the ring finger. 
And here we're going to be using the middle finger and the index finger to create our mudra. And here, extend the arms all the way out and then bring your index finger down and the middle finger up. I know it looks a little bit rude, but you, <laughs> this is in a different context, okay? So we're using that diagonal. You can see there's a diagonal between the, the first finger and the middle finger. And that's what's breaking up the channel of negativity. So we're using an angle, it's called a gutga. And here now we start the mantra. We're not here for very long, so focus with me now. Close your eyes, focus on the third eye, and let's begin. Relax your hands anytime you need to, but stay steady as best you can. Ready? Ek Onkar Sat Gur Prasad. Sat Gur Prasad Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar Sat Gur Prasad. Sat Gur Prasad Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar Sat Gur Prasad. Sat Gur Prasad Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar, Ek Onkar, Sat Gur Prasad, Sat Gur Prasad, Ek Onkar. Inhale deeply. And exhale completely, relax your hands all the way down to your knees, place your hands on your knees. Stretch the arms all the way up. Hold the breath now. Keep your hands up and exhale. Inhale very deeply, stretch up as high as you can, hold the breath. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Relaxing your hands all the way down. 
bring your one palm on top of each other and relax your hands down to your lap. Close your eyes and focus in between the eyebrows and slightly above. That's it, that's all. Focus in between the eyebrows and slightly ab above and breathe. Keep your attention on your third eye and visualize a huge rectangular tank of water surrounded by a marble walkway. Imagine there is a huge gate on the west side of the walkway. And from this gate, a bridge goes out to a holy temple in the middle of this tank of water. In the temple, music is playing. Hear it and experience it. Inhale very deeply. And exhale completely. Inhale. Exhale. And then blink your eyes open. Come back to reality. Drop a comment below and explain or describe, share with us that visualization that you had. And for those of you who know, that visualization was an experience of the Golden Temple in India. It's called in Amritsar. So drop your comments below. When I visualized just now with all of you, I remembered my time there and the incredible people that I met and the feel of the water of that temple. Beautiful. Let's close our practice now. Long such short nam. Sa. Na Please ground yourself, bring your forehead and your palms to the ground, closing off the energy of today's practice. Always a pleasure to be with you. We got rid of some neg negativity. And if you are in a bit of a spiral, one time is great, but doing it daily consistently having this as a constant companion in your daily life for the next 40 days, 90 days, 120 days, however long it takes, make that commitment. It's for you. Nobody's watching this just for you as an opportunity to know that change is in your hands. We're not getting bounced around just because other people want that to happen, but rather you have the opportunity to do that for yourself. My name is Salima, yoga therapist, and if you're looking for other ways for us to work together, think about yoga therapy. This is a really powerful way to explore what your 
unfolding in your life in a deeper way. Numerology is great for one or two sessions, but how do you extend that learning? That is through yoga therapy. And we can talk about business. We can talk about relationships, personal life, spiritual development, you name it, we can go there. And if you're looking for information about that, head over to my website, yogavision.com. And there we'll have the remedy ready for you. Lots of love to you. Until next time, see you soon.